Are you doing what you want now? Why the fuck do you think about what you want? Yes, 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 yes. Hey, you guys welcome to the channel so frederick leonard's wife peggy has actually shared what it feels like to be married to an egotic man if you don't know what it means to be an egotic so man so the Igbo tribe is a tribal from nigeria so according to her her man is behaving just like people from that place you understand like he's very cultural he's very traditional that's what she means you know he behaves like people from his tribe so she was in this um the car with her husband and you guys could see that she was making this video with um frederick in the picture but she was also giving us small small side view and i was thinking that i would end up seeing them like lovey doovey um you know small small clips where they were you know all lovey lovey but she was really just filming herself and i think the music changed and it now became like the egotic music according to her and she said oh that's what it feels like to be married to somebody from this tribe or who is very cultural who is very traditional and this kind of music that she listens to and i think their driver understood the assignment and played the kind of music Oga wants to listen to anyways even though we did not get to see her husband's face you know two of them together doing lovey lovey we got to hear his voice at least and know that he is in the car with her and you know this marriage is going well you guys know all the rumors has been you know spreading about this, this marriage so when i see them together i'm always very happy and i say let me come and show my people know that these people are still together you know and when she was making that video and maybe she made more videos of you know her and her husband but she decided to post only the one where she was in and it just got me thinking that is there something that is happening on social media media that's making these celebrities scared more and more scared you know to post their selves and their significant others publicly so i know that like i said she probably must have made a video with her husband maybe taking a picture with her husband but she showed us the one she took um she did only herself she doesn't want us to talk she doesn't want um all the speculations online but at least you've seen side view you've seen small hand you've seen freddie clonard's hand you've heard his voice so you know that okay the marriage is working but I think they just try sometimes to limit the amount of exposure that they give to the internet and you will not blame them because when they begin to show for instance if she's posting her husband five times a week the week that she will post three times we will say hey she has posted three times this week oh is something wrong did frederick um, offend her or did you see frederick with another person or did you see her with another person you know rumors will begin to fly and even um when she let's assume that she's angry with her husband and she doesn't want to post you know she will now say oh let me not post this and people now say oh something wrong with their marriage she did not post today or she didn't post she used to post by 6 p.m on wednesdays and she has not posted today so i guess with all the speculations and when you begin to post fans just really want to see sometimes fans are doing this out of love but sometimes there's just a thin line between love and you know um respect or uh, just taking what your favorite gives you you know that kind of thing you like this person you like these people you like them together but you don't just respect them and take whatever information about them that they choose to give you just a few weeks ago she celebrated her husband's birthday she surprised him she shared the video on her youtube channel and, and on instagram too yes we posted that on this page you know where she celebrated her husband and they were all lovey lovey kissy kissy and everything so it was so good to see them together and also weeks later to see them together in the car even though even though even though we did not see <laughs> you know them all mushy mushy we know that they are there together so yes i guess we get to manage that part that she showed us if you follow me on this page you know that i know how to manage i know how to manage whatever my people give me if they give me half gist i take it <laughs> if they give me just side view i take it if they show me only finger of ring i take it you know i don't i don't used to press anybody don't do more than you can do don't do more than yourself anything you post online we talk about it based on what you have posted so that's what we do here you guys let me know what you think about you know this video and how crying out that she's married to a very traditional man and i think it has advantages too because i've seen her bragging in some places that her man provides for her 100 percent so you see <laughs> yeah yeah you're yeah, winning in some peggy you're winning you're winning in some places so you can let me know your think in the comment section is the real show thank you for watching please like share and subscribe i'll see you guys in my next video Bye bye